Why is the government suddenly concerned about NyQuil chicken? Until the FDA posted about it, NyQuil chicken was not a social media trend, or was it? Uh, just a revolting post from the halls of viral infamity. This is what BuzzFeed.News has to say. Well, let's look into this, right? Until the FDA posted about it, NyQuil chicken was not a social media trend. It was just a post from maybe TikTok. Uh, now it's trending on Twitter and dozens of news articles. Don't cook your chicken in NyQuil, CBS one um, have been written about a social media challenge that doesn't really exist. So in September on the 15th, news released on the FDA's official website titled The Recipe for Danger, Social Media Challenges Involving Medicines, the agency warned that the social media video challenge that encourages people to cook uh, chicken in micro is unsafe. My thing is this, um, I have seen plenty of posts all over the internet about this nightfall chicken and people are actually doing it as you can see by the pictures and these pictures have come from everywhere all over the internet there are dozens on them viral on tiktok viral on reddit viral on twitter and so many other social media outlets that you probably don't even use because it's not you know, Instagram or, you know, the first five popular, but there are so many social media networks out there and every one of them, almost, almost every one of them has this information and this news about this chicken that's cooked in NyQuil and it's called Sleepy Chicken, right? Okay, so as for who would ever attempt to cook chicken in cold medicine, the answer is, of course, who? <laughs> Kids. Obviously, NyQuil chicken has been internet folklore for years. In 2017, a user who went by Cook, Cock, uh, posted a series of photos of boiling chicken tenders and green NyQuil attempting to make it into a burrito, then putting it in a blender with red NyQuil and straining it through their French press. Uh, screenshots posted to Emerger went viral on Reddit. In January 2022, a few videos about the concoction sparked news coverage. So BuzzFeed News found some now deleted TikToks from earlier this month in which people stitched themselves, reacting with horror to those earlier viral videos that did not make the chicken themselves. Nor would I. First of all, it's got to taste disgusting, and who would do such a thing? I mean, but obviously there are people out there who have tried it, people out there who have been warned about it, and BuzzFeed says, as we saw in the past, when Tide warned people not to eat its laundry pods, when businesses or government authorities issued warning about social media challenges that aren't even popular, they trigger news coverages that then inform the public about something silly and dangerous. So do you think this is really a trend? Have you heard about it? Sleepy Time Chicken was just another goofy gross out food that no one was actually trying to eat. That's what BuzzFeed.News tries to say. Hours after TMZ wrote about the announcement, a week after the FDA issued its warning, NyQuil Chicken was trending on Twitter with thousands of news posts every hour. Do you think this is real or do you think the FDA made it up? Do you think it's been blown out of proportion by social media? Teacups, let me know what you think in the comments below because this is crazy to me. I cannot believe that something like this is going on. And if the FDA really put out a fake story just for it to go viral, isn't this to give some type of rules? I mean, I don't know, but let me know what you guys think in the comments, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace out. Love, light, and more hair grease if you use it. If not, it's all right. Remember to live on purpose. Be careful out there, and I will talk to you guys in another live stream or video. Bye for now.
sweet, sip your tea, get cozy, it's time to go in with your girl locked in. Come on in, grab a seat, sip your tea, get cozy, it's time to go in with your girl on the tour. Take a little show. Come on in, grab a seat, sip your tea, get cozy, it's time to go in. Get cozy, it's time to go in with the girl of the tour. Day and then show, only on YouTube, only on YouTube.